The Oregon Employment Department says it's still waiting for direction on how to implement an executive order on unemployment from President Donald Trump. That executive order was designed to give an extra $400 a week to people receiving unemployment, but the department says it's looking into where that money will come from. Fox 12's Drew Reeves is live with what we know right now. Drew? Yeah, we do know that the president signed that executive order to increase weekly benefits since the $600 a week uh, from the CARES Act ran out. However, there are still many questions around exactly when those benefits will actually go out and just how much of a bump people are actually going to get. This week, Treasury Secretary Steven Mnuchin stated that states could start implementing these benefits within a week or two. But the Oregon Employment Department says with so much uncertainty, it doesn't see that happening in Oregon or any other state. When President Trump originally signed the executive order this weekend, it stated that people would be eligible to receive an additional $400 a week, but that states would have to cover $100 of it. However, the Employment Department says that that has been clarified to say that states could cover their $100 portion with underlying employment benefits. That means it appears states can either just add $300 extra or contribute an additional $100 themselves if they choose. The department says it's checking for more clarity on this. The department says that if it does have to give out an additional $100 a week in extra benefits, it's something that the state could financially afford. We went into this with one of the healthiest unemployment insurance trust funds in the nation. It continues to be in good shape. So this is certainly a huge stress on it, but the statutory formula that the legislature created was designed to weather really severe needs. The department also touched on several bills that passed by state legislators in the special session. One bill will allow people who are able to go back to work part time to get weaned off their unemployment as they get more hours rather than cut off completely. Another will help self-employed workers get their benefits more quickly. The department says it is pleased that both those bills were able to pass. Now, an additional bill did not pass and it would have allowed school employees to avoid adjudication while getting their benefits when schools are on a break. The department says it will continue working with those employees to get them their benefits as quickly as it can. Reporting in North Portland, Drew Reeves, Fox 12 Oregon.